Meanwhile, the recent terrorist attacks in Kaduna and other parts of the north have heightened growing concerns about insecurity and the failure of the government to do anything about it. This was a position of the uh, Rule of Law and Accountability Center, RULAC, where a briefing newsmen on its community access to justice and criminal justice interactive project. Executive Director of RULAC, Okechuku Nwagome, who called for the registration of the present government, who called for the resignation of the government, says it is alarming that despite the huge borrowings ostensibly to combat terrorism, insecurity continues to grow. As the nation approaches 2023, he advises Nigerians to take interest and prepare to ensure that they elect only competent people who are capable of delivering good governance. It has never been as tragic before as it is to today. The people in government today, when they were in opposition in the time of former president, good luck, Jonathan, were the ones who went to the streets in Abuja protesting uh, over insecurity. They called Jonathan incompetent and asked him to resign. Of course, we knew that things were not good then, but we thought that things were going to get better. Seven years into the administration of you know, President Buhari, things have got worse. If you look at Kaduna State, where you have more than close to 30 you know, security for formations ranging from the military, the police, you know, civil defense, the SS, yet Kaduna State has become an ungoverned space. Citizens are now living at the mercy of ruthless terrorists. The government has no answer. You can see that the state has become locked down. Airports have canceled flights to and from Kaduna. So that tells you clearly that Kaduna is completely under the control of terrorists. And this is not, it's not just Kaduna. Between yes, two, two days and today, we have heard of attacks in, 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 in other places in the north, like in George, in Nasarawa. So the, it has become evident that the present government has no answer to insecurity. And the only thing we have to ask for is for them to resign the way they asked President Jonathan to resign. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.